Only castles made of sand Fall into the sea Good morning YouTube fam Look at this place This is straight out of a movie scene I feel like we're in the deserts of Africa. Look, Nipsey looks like a lion in the Sahara Desert. Nipsey, what is this place? Hey YouTube fam, William Cody here. Another edition of The Lost Ones. And I had just had to come live and show you all this place. It's straight out of like, the surface of Mars or something. And this is Colorado. <laughs> Look at this. So this is Great Sand Dunes National Park. Look at it. It's straight up desert. The real desert. Sugar sand. Nipsey likes it. Look at Nips. Nipsey. <laughs> Nipsey cannot believe it. Guys, I just had to show you this place. Talk about weird energies. It's a crazy feeling here. I'm sure. It's like there's beautiful mountains of Colorado. Right there in front of us. And then you keep turning 180 degrees and it turns into like the deserts of Egypt almost. I feel like any minute we could see Jim Morrison walking across the sand. <laughs> but I just had to show you all this magical place that seems to be out of place in, for Colorado. And the reason why this place is like this it's because all this down here in this canyon used to be a giant lake at one time. And after droughts and such, it's all dried up and the sand left over. The winds have blasted it so much that new trees and life can't plant. There's not many minerals left. So it's just kind of turned into this crazy desert area. And the winds are blowing. Of course, I can't do a video without wind. You guys know that. But look at this cliff. We're going for it. Whoa. <laughs> it's steep, guys. <sighs> what do you think, girls? This place is magical. You know, it always takes away from it when bad people have been to beautiful places. Like, for instance, Gabby Petito and Brian Laundry spent several days here. And in her video blogs and her pictures, they were right here in this area. They rented a snowboard and hiked up these mountains and snowboarded down, having the times of their life, in love, possibly engaged. And then they moved on to Moab after this. They drove to Utah, which is the next state over. So that's when things started going wrong. Um, but I don't know. And then, of course, Chris Watts and his mistress, uh, who he's cheating on his wife with, of course, they came here too. He's the, in my opinion, he's the worst person to ever live. And they rented a snowboard and had a romantic getaway while he was cheating on his wife away from his family. And then soon after he goes and murders his whole family and disposes of their bodies. So it always takes away from the wonder and beauty of a place when horrible people have been here who've committed horrible crimes and acts. To me, it doesn't get worse than what Chris Watts did to his family. And I'm sure you've been keeping track of that piece of crap, Brian Laundry. He was found 
He offed himself, took the easy way out. But I'm, I'm sure you guys are with me. It was sure would have been great to have him have to go to prison and fend for his life in prison because they would have had a field day with him. But I try not to think about those bad people that have been here. Um, just recently, there was a fellow from New York, not recently, but 2017. Um, he came here on a vacation from New York uh, in February, and he actually got lost his first time here, was stranded out in the woods, out in the wilderness for five days, had to be rescued, got rescued, and uh, then he came back to visit in the same year and disappeared and then was found dead at a peak around here. So he had already been lost once and rescued and then went out and met his demise from the elements. So it's just a weird story. You know, he had been lost and a guy from New York. Uh, so you never know what people's motives are. Maybe people want to be lost. You know, it's a way out for them kind of um, to let the mother nature and the elements take them rather than like, you know, commit suicide I guess but I um, hope I don't get flagged for that word it's a, not really allowed on YouTube but it's a way out I guess and I wonder about some of these people I search for you know sometimes people don't want to be found and uh, you know you might be putting a kink in their life by looking for them and then finding them so Hey, hey, Cog. This place is cool, huh? But I just had to show y'all the Great Sand Dunes National Park. If you're ever in Colorado, come by and visit. It's like one of the great wonders of Colorado. So, man, it's strange. Mountains of sand from the wind blowing the sand all the way up there and making mountains out of it. Which is why we're here early in the morning, so we can take a video when it's not blasting wind. <laughs> sure y'all gotta be sick of that so what's on the plate for today <clears throat> we cleared the area all the way around miss hammond's house all the way to her neighbors so i've come to the conclusion that rochelle hammond actually made it so rochelle was hanging out at a house um before the night before she went missing and she, it was kind of like a party type deal house and um, so she left that party at about 4 15 a.m and came home and stayed at her mom's and then um, the next morning is when she went missing she was seen walking out and leaving the property and then never heard from again so what we what i've done is there is there was a cell phone ping um, right up the road from her house which would have been in walking distance and it was the house that she was hanging out at uh, the night before she went missing so what I'm gonna do today is go try to find that house um, it could be an abandoned house or several abandoned houses right there in that area so I'm gonna go and kind of peek in the windows of the abandoned houses and see if I can't match the wallpaper that are in some of the pictures she sent her mother the night before she went missing because what I think happens is she walked back to that house that she was partying at and who knows she could still be there right now um, so that's the plan for today um, stay tuned I'm gonna do another video of when uh, we're gonna be going up looking in these houses so I'll give you all some live footage but I hope you're having a wonderful day Nipsey's just loving herself look at this dog Nipsey say hi Nipsey says I don't know what this place is but it sure is fun the beautiful creation the creator made here and it is like something out of a music video guys <laughs> unreal but I hope you have a blessed day make sure if you're in Colorado don't think about Chris Watts and Brian Laundry being here because it'll mess with you it takes away from the beauty
But come visit this place. Maybe spend a few nights here. There's a weird energy around here. You'll feel it. But I hope you're having a blessed day. I'm going to cut this off because the wind's at blowing. Thank you for watching. Hit that like and subscribe. And turn on that notification bell. Thank you.